Good morning on day eight. Um, so I'm just going to put this out there and I don't know if it's just this plan itself or because it doesn't have like a lot of carbs or something, but I keep wanting to cheat. And I know yesterday we celebrated my son's um, birthday and my parents came over and of course we had like Danish and so I had a small piece because it's gluteny. Um, but like, it's not just that, like I keep wanting to cheat all the time. So um, I'm not real sure what the whole deal is. It's not really that I'm hungry. It's more like I'm craving sugary stuff. And so I don't know if the lack of carbohydrates has been like depleted in my body and I just need more. And of course this has like no um, starchy food. So I don't know, we'll see. Um, tonight actually is some starchy food because it's sweet potatoes. So I guess we'll see how well that fills me up and if I feel like cheating or not. Um, so today, um, I have not gained or lost any weight. I'm still the same. Um, but breakfast this morning is a tofu scramble with optional egg. Well, I cannot eat eggs because I don't, it doesn't sit well. Um, so this is basically, um, red pepper, tomato, garlic, onion, tofu, um, an egg if you want, Mrs. Dash, some nutritional yeast, and spinach. So, um, I did modify this because um, I bought all my groceries last week, so we're kind of on like slim picking groceries for because I'm supposed to this my grocery list ends in like two days um, for these meal plans because he doesn't do 14 days where you can go shopping on a Friday and a Friday and a Friday like that. So he doesn't do seven days in a row. So I had to stop at 10 days because we don't have money to go grocery shopping again until the Friday when I'm supposed to go grocery shopping. So um, I modified this a little bit. Um, I used the scallion. Um, I did not use red pepper because I put it in my salad yesterday, um, my big salad. Um, I didn't use any tomato. I don't like tomato cooked like that in like a scramble. Um, so I just left out the tomato. Um, actually didn't you, uh, basically this whole thing is not even on here. So what I did instead of this tofu scramble is the scramble that I like, which I use the tofu. Um, and then I use spinach, but I used, um, the scallions and I used celery and I used mushrooms and I cooked all that up. And so here's Okay, so I cooked that up like that. And then for lunch, you're supposed to have a micro chopped salad. And so I just grabbed the great big salad that I made and threw it in a container with some salsa. Um, it didn't really say on the micro chopped salad any kind of dressing. So I just put some salsa in here and I'm just gonna shake it and it'll basically wilt down to nothing. Um, and then fresh or frozen berries for dessert. So I grabbed the rest of the strawberries that were gonna go bad. And that is what I will eat for lunch. So I'm hoping that will work. And then um, for dinner tonight is sweet potatoes topped with black beans and kale. I looked, I don't have any kale. So I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that. I might either put spinach on or I still have some romaine I might put on there. Um, I don't know how I ran out of kale this morning. Like I just looked and there was nothing. So tonight it says two cups. So I might just use, um, spinach and it'll be fine. Doop, doop. Looking to see what all is in there. So, um, ugh. all right. So they're basically making like a loaded baked potato type of thing where you have onion, garlic, kale, black beans, tomatoes. Um, and then they have like a yogurt if you want to make like a, like a sour cream type of thing. Um, mm -mm. This makes one serving. So of course I have to make it make four servings. <laughs> so that's going to be tricky. Um, but yeah, we'll, I'm just, yeah, we'll just see if this works because it's carby. So we'll see how well that works. Um, I do really well on starch solution, but it, it, um, is more of like a maintenance plan for me. And so I think I'm going to have to add in a little more carbs than what he puts in here, like adding a little more rice or quinoa or something, because 
it just doesn't seem to be enough. So um, I will show you what dinner looks like um, when I get to that point. All right, thanks. Hey, so it's getting dinner time and I have one of my baked potatoes um, in the microwave. Um, somebody gave us a cheese pizza, so I'm like kind of making that for the boys. Um, and if my husband wants to eat it, that's fine too. But um, So I am in a pan. I have some onion, garlic, um, a, a can of black beans, an actual can of diced tomatoes, chili powder, cumin. Um, I tried to make this be like about two, um, one for me and one for my husband. I'm sorry. I look like crap. I always look like crap. Um, I just got done cleaning a house, so I'm just like whooped and I didn't sleep very well last night, but oh my goodness. So I'm going to show you in the pan what I have and I'm going to be putting that over a, um, sweet potato. So. Mm. This smells amazing. Um, I was craving a snack so bad. So I have these kind bars, um, in my car because they don't have any of my allergens in them. And sometimes I just get hungry and like, that's the better option. So I did have one of those today, um, around two o'clock, but the family's home. So I'll get back with you in a second. Okay. So here's what happened. Um, it's actually the next day when I'm recording this. So I made that, um, the black bean and the tomatoes and the garlic and all that stuff in there and the onions and the picture that I showed you cooking. And then, um, my husband got out the baked potatoes. He's like, Oh, we're supposed to just pour this over the top. And I said, yeah, I said, but it looks kind of like it tastes better with rice than over a sweet potato. He goes, yeah, I really want rice as well. So we had some rice in the refrigerator and so we dumped um, a thing of rice in. And so I still have the sweet potatoes like um, in the refrigerator. So I'm going to end the video with that. <laughs> it was great to eat rice. And I will see you tomorrow, today.